I'm a five lion skink. I live in Halliburton County, but you probably never see me. Firstly, I'm really, really fast. Second, I hide in the rocks and crevices. Third, I'm a species at risk, so there's not a lot of me left. I look like a salamander, but I'm actually a lizard. The only lizard native to Ontario. Because I'm a lizard, I have claws and scales, not just skin. So while a salamander's wet to the touch, I am nice and dry. Early last summer, my mom laid nine eggs in a little hideaway under some rocks. The eggs are the size of little jelly beans. Some other skink mothers were there with their nest. Because we are cold-blooded, my mother will go outside and lie on the hot rocks. And when she gets warm, she'll come back and wrap around the eggs. By the end of the summer, we're ready to hatch. When some babies are born, their mother had to feed them for a long time, sometimes years. But the time that I was one day old, I could run around and catch my own food. Crickets, flies, grasshoppers, beetles, ants, and spiders are my favorite. I hibernate in the winter, in the ground or under a rock, until about the middle of March. When I'm born, I have five stripes running down my back. But the best is when I get a little bit older, like a year, I have a very blue tail. My tail is so great. It's pretty fragile and it can break really easily. So if I get in a fight with a raccoon or a bird, I can drop my tail. But it'll, it will never work as good as my first one. That's a real problem because I store fat in my tail to live on when I hibernate in the winter. And when I get older, my tail fades and my stripes fade and I'm just brown. Old is like 10 years old, but mostly I don't live past the age of five. There's a lot of things that can get me. Birds, raccoons, but the biggest threat is humans. They destroy my habitat. They build their own houses. They also like to pick up rocks and build the duck shucks. Then I have no place to live. They also pave roads, and they also drive around in these really big cars. They also think I'm really neat, so they want to catch me and put me in a cage. All these things make it hard for skanks to survive. So now you know a little bit about me, even though you don't see me. If you leave rocks and twigs where nature put them, you can share the land. And maybe, just maybe, you'll see my blue tail racing past. Think skink.